everyone, welcome. I'm Maricela from EVPL Central, and you're watching Recipes from My Kitchen. Today we're making elegant brunch eggs, and these eggs are extraordinary. They're made with puff pastry, so, you know, buttery, flaky, what is there not to like about that? And then you can add a whole slew of things. I'm adding cheese today, tomato. I've got this really beautiful aromatic basil plant, so I'm going to add some basil. You can add spinach, anything you want. Green pepper, red pepper, jalapeno. I've also got some tomato. I'm going to put a little ham in there. Sometimes I even go into my fridge and if I have some leftovers I can put in there, I will. And then of course it's got the eggs in it. You know, I like it for three reasons. It's absolutely delicious. It looks amazing. It looks so beautiful, so elegant, and it's really easy to make. So let's start cooking. already at 400 degrees and I started transferring these over to the tray. I lined the tray with parchment paper and you know the scoring it's just scoring. I did not cut all the way through and the reason you score these is because you want to form an edge around this pastry. So we're gonna put them in the oven for about eight to 10 minutes and they're gonna start rising. We're gonna take them out and we're going to, with a spoon, the back of the spoon, we're gonna kind of squish the middle down and, and then fill it up and, and that'll form the edges. You'll see when we get there. Mmm, this smells so good. Okay, now they're not fully cooked. Uh, they, I said I was going to put them in the oven for about eight minutes. I actually left them about 10. And as you can see, they've puffed. Now I'm gonna take the back of this spoon and I'm going to just push the centers in.
so I, I finished putting in the ingredients. I'm going to put it back in the oven. Um, the puff pastry doesn't need very much to cook, but I'm just going to cook what's inside the eggs. Make sure the um, cheese has melted. So it's going to be, I'd say, maybe another seven minutes. I'll just watch it. Okay, so I've got my eggs out of the oven. Now, you can leave them in longer if you prefer to have a firm yolk. These are exactly like I like them. My favorite part of this show, the taste test, of course. Oh, yum, yes, look at that. Ooh, it's runny, it's delicious. But like I said, you could leave it in for a bit longer if what you prefer is to have a firmer yolk. Mmm, mmm, mmm. These are extraordinary. You're really going to enjoy making them, serving them. And you saw how easy it was. Try them. You're going to love them.